People with depression always hear the same things. Why are you sad? Why can't you just be happy? You know people have it worse than you. You're just looking for attention. But it's more than just being happy. You don't have to have a bad life to have a bad mind. At first, it's really difficult. You slowly start to stop doing the things you enjoy. You never have the energy to complete a task that you would be excited to do before. You realise that you're not yourself when you're around people and you just don't have the energy to be with them. And so you just force a smile because acting how you feel will make everyone around you question why you're sad. You either pretend to be happy with them as to not be called a liar or as to not annoy them with your thoughts. You know that there are people that may have worse lives than you and so instead of talking to people you just keep it in your own head because it's much easier for you to fake being happy than making everyone around you question why you act like you do. You spend your days staring at the walls, the ceilings, the screens hoping that you can just have a grasp of some motivation to do something. You then realise that you're tired and you've already wasted a day of your life doing nothing when you know you could have done something else. You then get into bed, annoyed at the fact that you've wasted your day but couldn't do anything about it. Waking up is even harder because you feel like it's just going to be the same thing again. But you motivate yourself to get up, wanting to do something and then you can't. You instantly just lose all energy and just can't be bothered and so again you just wait out another day. It's a cycle you just seem to be stuck in. There are times when people may notice a difference and ask if you're okay but you just say you're fine and to not worry and again you just put on a fake smile because you don't want them to worry or be annoyed and so again you're smiling for their sake. There may be bursts where you actually manage to do something and you feel happy. But then that's it. You've done that one thing, so now what? It's just back to being with your thoughts again. And being stuck in your mind is the worst place to be stuck because you know how you want to feel, but you can't make yourself feel that way. And so you get more annoyed at yourself because you just want to be happy. You try and tell yourself each night that it'll get better tomorrow and that you'll be happy. But then that turns into the next day, and then the day after that. And now it's been too long to count. You don't want to always feel like this. Why is unhappiness now part of your personality? You've become the unhappiness that you wish to get rid of. People around you get on with their lives, and you can feel yourself trying so hard to fit in, but you're crying for help with your mind just wishing that someone can take it away. You know that you're never alone as people are also feeling like this and some people may try to help. But in the end, you just give up trying to truly be happy and instead just go through each day the same. They say things take time but how long can this keep going on? You just wish for the day that you could go back to being normal because you've forgotten what it's like. If anyone is struggling or needs help in any sense, then I please urge you to contact someone that can help. No matter your situation, even if you think there's no reason or you think it's not as important as the other person's, it's all important. And there are people out there that are willing to help you in any way they can. Please, don't go through it alone.